All right, we're going to create our repository for all of our Web 105 files. So I'm going to create a new repository, and I'm going to name it Web 105. And I'm going to make it with a description of Web 105 2020. The description is optional. It's public. You can make it private if you choose. You must initialize the repository with the README. And now I'm going to create a new file. And I'm going to put in my file name, my folder name, which is review, because this is the book review. And then I'm just going to put in a delete me dot html. This is just because I want to upload my file. Um, this is creating the folder. I could have used index.html since I only have the one file and I could have pasted it here. But I want to show you how to do it when I just want to upload a bunch of files. So I'm going to commit this new file. I'll delete it in a few minutes. I'm going to upload the file for my folder and choose my, from my file, which is in my D drive. I'm in my Web 105 folder. I created a review folder and index is my only page. So I'm going to open that. And then I need to commit my change. Once I've put the new folder file in there, I can actually go into the review file and I can delete the delete me. And I can grab it or delete it. Again, I could have just created index.html and copied and pasted it, but often I want to grab a whole bunch of files at once, and this is slightly easier. So now, if I want to hand this in, I would need the whole path up here. I would copy this. And when you're handing it in in an assignment, typically you're going to hand in the assignment as a link to the actual page on the mccdgm.net server, and you'll post this in the comments section when you hand in your assignment so that you can show me that you also uploaded it to GitHub.